everyone and welcome to my channel. Now, I decided to do a monthly haul. Every end of a month I'm going to show you the product that I bought during that month and this is going to be a January haul. Now I know <laughs> it's February and I'm a little bit late with this video but I wasn't really feeling well and had a lot, lot of work to do so yeah. I'm a, bit, a little bit late, but you, I hope you don't mind. If you like this video, give a thumbs up, keep on watching, and don't forget to subscribe. I was in Sephora, and I bought a couple of things that I really, really wanted to try. I think all of the products that I have here from Sephora was something that YouTube made me buy. Just seeing other YouTubers using these and trying these products out. I was curious and I want to get them and try them myself. The first thing that I bought was, well, let me see, was this Too Faced Peach Blush. It's called uh, Papa Dom Peach. And this peach smells wonderful. I really like, like the packaging. I really like this color and this peach looks so, so cute. And I really like this color on other people that I saw using this blush and I just wanted to have it myself. And that, that's the blush that I have today. If you can see I don't wear a lot of makeup today. I still don't feel very well. And I just don't, I only have a BB cream and a little bit blush, mascara, some eyeshadow, just one eyeshadow on my eyelid. So I don't look very tired. I have a cold that still don't feel very well so. I hope you don't mind, but I really, really wanted to do this video for you. Now, this blush looks like this, and it's really, really nice packaging. They did a wonderful job with this one. And when you open it, a little mirror, and this is how the blush looks like. And it smells... It smells peach, but I think it smells like candy. <laughs> and I really like this blush. It's soft and very, very nice. I don't know if you can see it, but it's what I have on my cheeks today. Uh, and I bought one of these also for my sister because she really wanted uh, to try this one too. And because I like it and I know she's going to like it too, I bought one for her. really love this one. It's great, really great blush. When I was in Sephora, I had to grab one of these, and this is the Sweet Peach Too Faced Creamy Peach Oil Lip Gloss. And I did all swatches in the store when I was in Sephora to see how they looked, and and this was the only one that really I thought was interesting, and I thought this would look good on me because the other colors were beautiful, really beautiful, but they were kind of too pinky. I don't know how to explain, and I didn't really thought that they will look good on me and I didn't want to buy all of them, maybe I didn't like because I I'm not really a lip gloss girl I like I love lipsticks but I was really curious to see how this looks on me and I'm glad that I bought it that's what I have on my lips today it's beautiful color and this is, it, this is how the packaging looks like and the applica applicator is looks like this smells very very nice and this is called peach teas the other colors were beautiful too but they was this one was my favorite it's a very very beautiful kind of peachy pink color and I love this one I needed to buy a um, eyebrow pencil because my Anastasia brow is was empty and I was curious to try this from Benefit precisely my brow pencil and I wanted to try and compare that with my Anastasia brow is that I used and I think I like this one more I don't know why I, f I feel like this one is more creamy and easy to blend into my eyebrows so I really really like this one. I got in color number three. I don't like to have too dark eyebrows and too light color would be strange on mine. But look at this packaging. 
This is so cute. I love it. And it's very nice. I don't know if you can see, but... And it's very easy to build up. I think this is a little bit harder than uh, Anastasia Browes, but I do prefer this because with my Anastasia Browes, when I did just do a one swap of this, it got too strong. But this is easy to build up and just do like strokes, if you understand what I mean. And I'm loving it, really loving it. So I prefer benefits. And then I just needed to get this product because everybody is just bra bragging about it that they're talking how beautiful it is and, and everybody on Instagram thinks this is the best product ever. And I'm talking about Better Than Sex Mascara. If you watched my other videos, you know that I always try new mascaras and I haven't found any that I really like, that I really stick to and use all the time. I haven't found that yet, so I wanted to give this Better Than Sex Mascara a chance. I bought the travel size of this regular and I bought the full size of waterproof Better, uh, better Than Sex Mascara. And if you wonder why I did that, I heard that many people think this one smudged a little bit, there are fallouts. And then I read somewhere, I think on a blog, I don't remember which one, but doesn't matter, that this one waterproof is much better because it doesn't smudge. Then I said, okay, I will buy this one. So I went to buy this one. But when I looked at the packaging, I noticed one thing. And that was why I bought both of them. I saw this eye look here and I thought it was beautiful. But then I saw this one. Can you see? Look, if you compare these two, it's supposed to be the same mascara, but this one is waterproof and this one is not. But these lashes look thicker, longer and more beautiful. And this is what I wanted. But I wanted waterproof. So I was standing in Sephora and I was looking at this packaging and I was thinking what am I going to do? I want these eyelashes but I want it to be waterproof. So I t said to myself okay I will buy this waterproof one whole size because I want it and I'm going to buy this one trial size just to compare these two. And I was using these couple of days just to see how they were. Now I can say, I don't like this one. This is how it looks. I love the brush. It's big, it's beautiful, I like how it looks. And it really, really makes my eyelashes long and beautiful and thick. But my God, my eyes look like a disaster after a couple of hours. I was all black down here and on my eyelids. And I looked like somebody punched me in my face. I have never experienced that. I, I did experience that with all the mascaras that I bought. But never like this. And never before I looked terrible. My eyelashes still look long and full. I have black circles. Oh my god. I really didn't like this one. And I tried not to put this mascara on my eyes. Uh, low lashes. It, that works better, but it didn't. So I was really disappointed with this one. I don't know why everybody likes this mascara. Is this only... I think... can't be only me, because I, I read that a couple of people don't like this one, uh, but I still bought it and using it. I will never do that again, but okay. And then I tried this waterproof and look how this one is so beautiful, it, la it has like water drops on it. So nice packaging, love the color, love the bl brush. It's the brushes look the same, it gives the same effect as the other mascara, so it's not really like this, it really looks like the other one, but it gave me almost same results. After three hours, I had a little bit dark pores down here, 
but wasn't as bad as the other one but it still smudged on my face I didn't like it and yesterday I tried this mascara again and I didn't put it on my lower lashes just to see if that would work better and it did and it does smudge a little bit but not too much so I will definitely give the, uh, this one a chance and I will use it a couple more times just to see if I don't know stop stop smudging or something I don't know it's not the best mascara I don't know if I'll buy this again I probably won't but I will keep on using just to give it more chances if you understand what I mean maybe not when I bought all of these things I got a present and I'm very glad I did because I got a t uh, mascara melt off from Too Faced and I got this travel size this is a cleansing oil waterproof mascara dissolver and this is antioxidant rich green tea extract infused to help protect lashes and this you put on your eyelashes and you leave it for 60 seconds and then you swap away the dissolved mascara with a damp cloth or makeup wipe and this is how it looks. It's a very cute kitsch jean. And it's a very, really small, I would call it a brush. Uh, and I did try this a couple of times. And I love this. It took all of my waterproof mascara. This one. It took it off immediately. I put this on my eyelashes, left it for 60 seconds. And I wiped this off with uh, my makeup wipe and it was gone. I haven't tried anything like this before and I'm very very glad, glad I did got this as a present because I'm definitely going back to Sephora and buy the full size. I'm loving this product. And that was everything I got from Sephora and but it's not everything that I bought. I have a couple of more things to show you. I bought this LA Girl Pro Coverage Foundation. Now this is really not my color. No, it's not. But I can probably make it work. I wanted to see if this foundation is as good as everybody is saying. This is Nude Beige. I haven't tried it because it is a little bit too dark. I got this Revolution uh, Pure Pigments. And I got the four colors. They have more colors but I couldn't find. Let me just do swatches so you can see how they look. This is the green one that I got. Look how beautiful this is. It's very pigmented. It's almost green and gold at the same time depending on the light how the light hits it. But look how beautiful it is. Look at this pink purple one. It's beautiful. Metallic. Very, very nice color. I like it. This one is beautiful too. It's kind of black and gold at the same time. It's very beautiful. Yellow, gold, green and black. And the, and the last color that I could put my hands on is this one. And this one is my favorite. And it's kind of black, purple, blue. Yeah, black, purple, blue color very beautiful very pigmented and the last product is this revolution ultra strobe balm you can apply with fingers or brush so i have tried this one it's so beautiful i just put my fingers in it i see i can see if i can do a swatch for you oh this one is beautiful really really beautiful really creamy really soft I don't know if you can see it, kind of purple bluish. Let me just apply it a little bit. Can you see it? It's very, very easy to blend. I can't see anything. It doesn't come with a mirror, that's a minus. But look how beautiful this is. Oh my god. Really like it. Really, really like it. Can you see it? Cute. I use it like this. And I'm very happy how it turns out, how it looks. That was all the products that I bought in January. 
I promise with February haul I won't be late as I did now with this video but I hope you liked it give a thumbs up thank you for watching and you if you haven't please don't forget to subscribe bye